Hi, uh, my name is Amit. Uh, I am the product manager of Smart Connect. Smart Connect is a glue which connects different devices running on different operating systems together and provides seamless transitions between devices like tablet, PC, and phone. Smart Connect 1.0, which we had introduced last year, already is power packed with a lot of features which enhances user experiences, where user can be on any of the devices and they don't have to go to seeking for other devices just to get some content. What we are bringing here is, we are bringing continuous improvement for end users. We started with having features like phone on PC. User can show their phone on PC or on tablet. And then we realized that user may not need the entire phone's view on the uh, PC because that's very compute intensive. So then we started introducing a streaming of just an application instance. Then people wanted more. So we brought in some intuitive gestures where if you have an application which is running on your foreground and suddenly your friends wants to say, hey, show me here. So what we do, we have this swipe to stream gesture where the moment you have swiped it, it starts running on your PC immediately. Okay. But one more thing we realized as and when the AI is becoming stronger, we felt the need to bring in more AI powered features wherein user could speak naturally to their devices. So one such feature we are bringing is cross device smart actions, which is also called as show me this on that. What we are doing with this is let's say that we have a Moto AI, which is a prompt. Here we can just say launch Instagram on my PC. So the moment user said this, this could be for any kind of action, any kind of application on, on any kind of connected devices. It immediately opens up the applications onto your PC. Now, you could also say the same thing for any other application on, onto your tablet. So you can say, open WhatsApp on my tablet. Now, how beautiful this system is, it understands the object and the target based on the relation of the devices, okay. As user has this multiple devices, they will be working invariably at different times on each of these devices and working on different applications, they might be downloading a file here, a file there. And for any normal user, it is very difficult to recall which file was where. And that is one need which we found out. So what we have introduced with Smart Connect 2.0, there is a cross device search. The cross device search, the capability it brings is user is able to search for any of their files on any of their devices. So here, if you see, you have applications, applications from tablet, applications from phone, and you have all the files. We also have a very good filter where you can go into a detailed view. You can categorically search whether the file should be from tablet, uh, phone, or PC, or any of these file type categories. As and when an AI capable device comes into the mix of Smart Connect ecosystem, it enhances the entire ecosystem as AI capable. So let's say I have a Lenovo Yoga Tablet Plus, which has an AI uh, search capability. So what we can do using this capability from any device, whether it's a PC or from phone, I can simply do a natural language semantic search. I can say places to eat, okay? When I said places to eat, it searches for file which might be stored anywhere. And in this instance, it finds out a file. It was in tablet and it's a natural language places to eat those file names and file contents are not there in the file but because of the power of ai it is still able to search and then you can share it with any of your friends with smart connect 2.0 what we are bringing is we are expanding this ecosystem where we had first pc tablet and display as 1.0 we are bringing ability where people can connect to their iot devices be it be watch, bird, stacks, or their VR headsets. And this is for the first time, Smart Connect would be also available to third-party Android devices. 
So on Windows side, we were already open. It used to work on any Windows 10 or 11 devices. With Smart Connect 2.0, it's going to work across any Android devices.